good things come to those who wait. Dwight Howard, bespeckled and ready to be introduced as the newest member of the Los Angeles Lakers. Howard has averaged 18 and 9 over his eight-year career. Let's listen in to what's going on out in Los Angeles. Thank you everybody uh, for coming here on a short notice on a Friday afternoon in Los Angeles. I know what that means to everybody here. Um, but our, our options for the press conference were Saturday and Sunday, and John Black has a waiting to go to on Saturday and Sunday. So rather than wait till Monday, we're having the press conference on a Friday afternoon in Los Angeles. Before I begin, um, I'd like to recognize the contributions of three players that were traded today, Christian Ianga, uh, Josh McRoberts, both of which who were here for a year or less, uh, young, promising players. You know, we wish them well and we thank them for their contributions. Uh, the other player that I'd like to recognize, Andrew Bynum, uh, has been with us for seven years. And I remember quite vividly having his press conference right here on this floor seven years ago when he chose number 17 because he was 17 years old. Uh, Andrew is a, a bright, hardworking uh, man who's going to have a very successful and productive NBA career, and we wish him well in Philadelphia. There's been a lot of speculation regarding Dwight being traded for the last six to eight to months to a year. Today, finally, the speculation comes to an end. And we're hopeful that 10 years from now, we can add a jersey onto that wall over there that says Dwight Howard. So at this time, I'd like to introduce the newest Los Angeles Lake with Dwight Howard. First of all, I just, just want to thank God for uh, today and uh, just this opportunity. I'm so blessed to be able to step on the court again, you know, uh, and it means a lot to me. And i just happy to be back, you know, uh, just sitting down in the hotel for four months. It's very tough on somebody like myself, you know, but, uh, you know, God has blessed me. And uh, I really appreciate, you know, things more now than I did before the surgery. And, uh, you know, I'm just happy. You know, I'm happy to be in front of you guys. You know, I'm happy to be here in, in L.A. And I've been in L.A. for four months. And it's like, it's been home for me. You know, it's been great. You know, I started off walking around Beverly Hills. And uh, every day, you know, I had... You know, this one lady who would always come, hey, come to the Lakers, come to the Lakers. And uh, if she's watching, I'm here, you know, so uh, <laughs> your wish came true. Uh, but uh, also, I just want to thank, you know, the city of Orlando and all the fans in Orlando for eight great years. Uh, you guys were the best. You know, I've had some great memories. Uh, sitting back, you know, in my room last night, you know, just thinking about all the things that have happened to me while being in Orlando, uh, the Superman uh, dunk, uh, the dunk over Tim Duncan, going to the finals and just, just seeing the city on fire, you know, 
for basketball, you know, is great. And I uh, just, I wish the organization, you know, a lot of success. Uh, thank Rich the Balls for drafting me eight years ago. And uh, now I'm happy to be a Laker. Uh, now it's, <laughs> I'm so excited. I mean, I, it's really hard to talk. Um, I couldn't sleep last night. You know, I had to try, not, try to stay away from ESPN. And as soon as I turned it on, it said breaking news. And I'm like, uh-oh. And it said you traded. So I'm, I'm like, oh, man. And thank God. So I'm just happy right now.